a Wilsterberg in a Porsche 911 Turbo S. Some might say it's the best sports car in the world. It costs 190,000 euros and has 560 horsepower. And we are feeling that right now. And this racetrack is totally sick. feel like driving Formula One without being in the Formula One car, this is maybe the right thing to do here. Whoa. You can feel the 911 is working so much and it's it's gluing to the road. It's unbelievable. And since this model year, the 911 also steers in the back. It doesn't only steer in the front, it also steers in the back. It's a really crazy system <laughs> in the air and my cameraman Holger is having a lot of fun as well here. Wow. I can't even look how fast we're going now, we're at 150. This is some insane... Whoa. So, let's go again. This is a completely new racetrack, built for testing purposes only. And God, I love the one who built this racetrack. So we are filming this by hand to show you how much power is applied to the drivers and especially to the co-drivers. You can't really hold the camera still because it's going so fast and the G-powers are so incredible. You really like going blind into the corners and letting it over 700 newton meters drive you into the seats. You gotta be kidding me. What? <laughs> this is really like a roller coaster. You don't really feel it's real. <laughs> This car, if you can call it car, accelerates in three seconds from 0 to 100 kilometers. And you can really use that one here. So how does this special back steering work? At a low speed, it steers you from the back wheels and steers in the opposite direction than the front wheels. So you get a more, more agile car. You can turn around slow corners very fast. And as soon as you, if you go fast, like when you like run 100 or faster or something, it steers in the same direction. So it delivers more stability on fast corners. And that's a really incredible system, which has its world premiere here in the new 911 Turbo. We have the Turbo S as well, with 40 horsepower more than just the Turbo. 